Heading into the weekend, and half of it looks pretty good. I think you'll figure out which half very quickly. Let's take a look at the forecast this evening. 7 o'clock, 48 degrees. We're looking at those clouds breaking up now. Partly cloudy conditions expected as we go through the evening hours. Temperatures heading down to 40 degrees at 11 o'clock, but then we'll cloud up again past midnight. And then tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, looks like a chilly rain falling around the Miami Valley, about 34 degrees. And the upper atmosphere could cool enough, uh, and also the uh, lower levels that we may even see some wet snow. Snow mixed in with some of the rain as we go into the afternoon, maybe even a transition over to some wet snow, especially across our counties to the west, out in eastern Indiana, and up to the north and west of town. So that's something we will watch as we go through the day. Right now, it looks like if we see any accumulation with temperatures staying above freezing, it'll be mostly on the grass, any kind of elevated surfaces out there, some brief accumulations, and it won't be staying around very long either. There are those uh, chilly temperatures tomorrow, mid and upper 30s across the Miami Valley because of the cloud covering rain, and it was. Windy this morning as a cold front moved in and some rain. We saw a gust up to 45 miles per hour. Our Storm Team 2 weather network site in Springfield, 36 Beaver Creek, and 35 in Eaton. Tonight, over in Eaton, those clouds are breaking up a bit at time lapse at the Preble County Sheriff's Office on our Storm Team 2 weather cameras. So, uh, briefly, partly cloudy skies early tonight. Not much range in temperatures as we talked about yesterday. Very narrow range there between 45 and about 55 degrees, although 56 was our high this this morning, but we've spent most of the afternoon between 50 and 55, and only three hundredths of an inch of rain since midnight at Dayton International Airport. It's dry now on live Doppler 2 HD, but already our next area of rain and potentially some snow working up from the southwest across Arkansas and down into the southern part of Missouri. Still rain on the northwest side of this system, but later tonight, that's when we may start to see some of the flakes of wet snow mix in on the northwest edge of that system. 50 degrees right now with a west northwest wind at 12 miles. An hour. We have a wind chill factor at 46. Winds are beginning to ease off a little bit. Notice the temperatures, 40s to the north. It's still some mid 50s on the map down south as you head towards Wilmington. And uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, current wind speeds out of the northwest at about 10 to 15, gusting up to 20. But we'll see those winds diminish to 5 to 15 and turn to the northeast later on this evening. So tonight stays dry on our future track forecast model, but you'll see those thickening clouds again past midnight. And then tomorrow morning at 6 o'clock, some of that rain working up into the southern part of our viewing area. Over us during the uh, morning hours, mid-morning hours and into the afternoon, you can see some of the blue and some of the pink mixing in there, some of the rain and some of the snow mix that will swing across our region. But tomorrow looks like a breezy, chilly day. At least we dry out and get back to some sun on Sunday. Clouding up again past midnight, could see a late night shower, 34, and then that mixture of rain, probably rain first and then a mix of rain and snow or a transition to wet snow tomorrow with a high of only 37 and once again not much temperature movement as we go through the day on Saturday. Storm Team 2 seven day forecast looking better on Sunday though. Sunshine and 50 and look at those temperatures Monday and Tuesday up into the 60s.